you too what is going on man uh it's been a minute um i haven't been on here in a minute man i've just been you know chilling but i've been mainly streaming on twitch so if y'all go check that out man um it'll be well appreciative of y'all going to check that out man uh but i'm back now uh i'm really gonna be hitting this hard i've been i've been on a a little you know what i'm saying just been chilling for a little bit but i'm i'm really gonna take start taking this very seriously uh i plan on doing a, um plan on being a uh game designer when i grow up i figured out how much money they're making that's that's great that's great i'll be set for life when i get done um, I plan on being the best, best um, game designer of all time. So yeah, y'all look toward that. But right now we're gonna talk about something that I have a problem with in 2K right now. So let's go ahead and let me turn down this audio right quick. Turn down this audio. Let's talk about my team 2K24. Uh. One thing I have a problem with is defense. The defense is terrible. Everybody knows it. People should know it by now. But, yeah, the defense is absolutely horrendous. It is terrible. I don't know why. 2K need to fix this. But, as y'all know, everybody in this game just spam screens nowadays. And I have a big problem with it. It's like this game takes zero skill now, you know. Like you don't have to, you don't have to, uh, you don't really have to try in order to uh, score. Now, it's just this right here with Curry. Let me show it right quick. This right here and probably doing what's that little move you do? Yeah, it's just it's just simple moves like that. And then just keep on spamming screens and just keep scoring. Uh, but yeah, man, it's it's, it's very annoying. I, I give it that, man. But I mean, at the end of the day, you really can't do anything about it. Only thing that can really do it is just nerf screens, and I would love that right now. And they was talking about how they took the triangle cheese out of the game. They really didn't, to be honest, because I went through it last game. Dude was just sitting here. He would have David Robinson in the corner. I would be off-balling him because I'm not on-balling somebody that's just going to spam screens the whole time and I'm on-balling him, which I feel like me on-balling you is showing you respect that I don't feel like being screened the whole time. But no. I on-ball I on, on a – not on-ball. I off-ball onto a – David Robinson, and all he does with David Robinson is he backdoor cuts. Now, I thought those was out of the game, but it looks like they're not. So, it's a lot of stuff. I just got banned just a while ago for uh, pressing pause too many times. I'm trying to fix the defense and everything like that, trying to figure out what to do. It still don't work. Um, I'm just trying to figure out anything possible just to figure out how to how to make this game a lot better, man. Uh, it's don't get me wrong, bro. It's not working, bro. It's 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 not. It's, it's really not, bro. Just to get y'all, just to just to help y'all out a little bit, man. There's no defense in this game that can stop screens. None. None. On ball won't work. None of that will work. All you can do. This is a scoring based game. It's all you can do is score. If you don't score, they're going to ram it down your throat. Pause. They'll ram it down your throat. And uh, pause again, by the way. It's just, it's, it's no way to play the game fun no more. You know what I'm saying? Back then, when you set screens, the dude was at least helping out. Now, if you own ball and set screen, if, if you own ball, your AI is going to mess it up. I'm going to just tell you that right now. Your AI is going to screw the whole play up. You can't really do what you want to do. So, I mean, I try. I try my best to figure out the best way to play defense on here. This game is going down in the mud hole, bro. 
look at all the stuff they add in this game, bro. Look at all this stuff that they're adding in this game right now. This is all uncalled for. If they start focusing back then like they did more on the gameplay instead of the rewards, this game would be a lot better than any game that come out nowadays. But they focus too much on the rewards and the they just that's what I'm saying, man. This game is not fun no more. Uh, if you want to have fun on the game, man, it's really solo games that you play, like God of War, anything like that, man. But this, my team has really hit a nerve, bro. After that last game, uh, my record is usually not like this at all. But you know what I'm saying? This is the team I have to use in order to win nowadays. I couldn't win just now because, I mean, I, I, I don't know at this point, bro. So this is what I stick to. You see 95 wins, 15 losses, <coughs> 15 losses, 1,000 made threes, bro. Like, I can't, I can't put it in no better words, man. It's just, it really took a soldier just to play this game, bro, because, I love this game so much, bro. 20, 2K20 by far, one of the best my team on the man. And like I said on Twitter, man, if they kept the content the same as they did, if they kept the content the same as they did in 2K20, bro, I would have no problem with 2K right now because I would be having fun. I would be having fun grinding the game. But... You can't have fun, bro. There's literally no way. No way. <sighs> Man. I've, matter of fact, y'all know, y'all see, I've spent money on the game. No, no lie to y'all, I have. Don't get me wrong. But when it got to the point where I was like, okay, I'm spending money on the game and I really don't be using these niggas like that. Like, excuse my language. Nigga, I don't mean to be saying that, but it's still. When it gets to the point where you think you got some of the best players in the game and you got the best defense and then you play against an amethyst team and you get beat. Like, in my eyes, bro, I'm using pure skill. All my games that I play, bro, I use pure skill. Every game. I don't set screens unless it's needed or it's like three seconds left on the clock and I need a little bucket. But it will be rare times that you see me set screens, man. But when you sitting there abusing I'm to all my cheeses out there, when you sitting there abusing screens and abusing them and abusing them, some people don't care that they're doing it, and some people don't care that they're being annoying. That's just the way people are nowadays. Really don't care. But when it comes, it's going to be a day where 2K actually figure out what they're doing and actually listen to what the people that's actually playing the game, they actually listen to us, and they figure it out like, oh, we we're actually doing this, okay. Then that's when y'all are going to be screwed. But I don't feel like 2K going to ever learn what they're doing, ever. But that's when y'all going to be screwed. That's when y'all really got to take the game seriously while I'm sitting back chilling because I already know how to play the game. Every year, it's a different game. Nobody can adapt. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I don't mind having a different game. But y'all adding more and more and more and more and more content. Con it's not even content that's, like, worth it. Like, the content that was worth it was probably the all-star thing, bro. That all-star stuff was fun. Not the all-star. Golly, what is it called? The Inferno stuff, fun. The, um, what else was it? The Gauntlet is pretty fun. The goal is all right, I guess, but we're trying to go 12-0 for a card. It's stupid. 
The Gauntlet's pretty fun. The Inferno's fun. But back in 20, you had the ground for that Cobra. That Cobra was probably the most fun I've had in 2K history. That's the most fun I've ever had. And then y'all kept dropping banger after banger. I don't forgot the mystery packs. Great. Great content. The uh, ball drop back in uh, 20 when you had the, what was it? Um, you won a game. And it would be like this card on the ball drop, right? That you could get. And then it would be packs on top of packs on top of packs on top of packs that you would get. I love that. If y'all can add that back inside the game, I'm telling y'all, y'all don't know how much money y'all would make. Y'all think y'all making money off of this? Off of this right here? If y'all put that stuff that y'all had back then in the game, bro, if y'all put that stuff back in the game, I'm telling y'all, y'all make more money than y'all ever had, bro. But people spending fifty dollars every single Friday is not it, bro. This is not it. This whole set by itself, hundred dollars. One hundred, not little, little, little hundred pennies. No, nothing. Fifty bucks that somebody could be spending snacks on, bro. Which I'm a false claimer. I'll be doing the same thing too. Which I understand. I don't need to be doing it. Only reason why I do it is because I feel like if I... It, opening packs brings me joy. If that makes sense. Like, if I got at least 500k MT that I got... Because I'm telling you right now, I'm spending it on packs. But these packs right here... And then on top of that, y'all downgraded the uh y'all downgraded the, the pack odds last week some of the best packs I've opened came from these base 20 packs matter of fact after I got after I got Curry and after I got Kurlinko and after I got uh T Mac I started ripping packs because I was like right, well I got MT so I might well spin it if y'all saw my streams, I had around 400k off of that, off of just opening pack. I started with like 75k. I started with like 100, 100k, something like that, and I ended the stream with almost 400,000 MT just because I kept opening packs, and I pulled T Mac, I pulled Curry. That's the stuff that we need, bro. That's the stuff that'll make people open packs, not just giving people players and expecting them to bomb every time, bro. Like. Dude, I can't I can't stretch it anymore, bro. Like, who am I? I can't say anything. I can't say anything to anybody. Don't nobody listen to me. You know what I'm saying? I'm the guy with 50 subscribers. You put it like that. I'm the guy with 50 subscribers. Don't nobody listen to me. I'm just a random guy. Look, bro. Like, content got to step it up. Because people saying this is good, bro, I really do not like them sets at all. Jordan, normal release, really? Really a normal release. And we're in January. Normal release in January, really? And it's Donnie McDo. Well, LeBron only get one Hall of Fame badge, bro. I think he only got like one Hall of Fame or something like that. Who followed me? Yeah, he only got like one Hall of Fame badge or something like that, bro. Like, really? That's what we doing? But, dog, like, <sighs> I'm telling y'all, once I get into this, like, gaming, designing, or whatever, bro, if I work for 2K, bro, I'm going to fix this for y'all. I'm going to have to. Ain't no, ain't no ifs or buts about it, bro. I have to fix it for y'all, bro, because... All people worried about nowadays is just the money, bro. That's all I worried about is the money. But yeah, man, uh, that's how I feel about it. 2K's defense is terrible. Um, if you think it's good, comment down below. I don't know what in your right mind think that's good, but you know, it's your opinion. What you think is what you think. I have no nothing against it. Um, yeah, man, y'all just. I don't know, man. I just can't. I can't stretch it any more than what it is, man. Screens need to be nerfed, though. Like, for real.
Like on a real note, strings need to be nerfed. But until then, bro, talk to y'all later, man. God bless. Don't forget to have God in y'all life, man. And that's, that's the end of the video, man.